basically I see it. All right, so we stopped at Waffle House so that Chanel's mother and her godmother can get something to eat because me and Chanel already ate. Yeah. There's no reason why she should be sweet like that. <laughs> Scared me! <laughs> ugly as shit. She's so ugly. It's fine, me too. With this fake ass wig I got on. I don't care, it look all right to me. We got 2D. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah, took a shoot. That was great. Hennessy. No, the not the Hennessy. I'm sorry, the small Hennessy. Tiny. Not the, yeah, the tiny. <laughs> no, 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 the one all the way in the back. Mm -hmm. To the yeah. right. Uh, how much is that one? This is 21. How, how much is the one at the top then? That 20. one is 21. No, the second, yeah, that one. These are basically the same size. This is just a one. Oh, I'll say y'all one. The cute one with the spout. I'm so excited because we found a crab place. The name of the crab place was Darla's. But I'm excited because we love crab. And this is my first cocktail. I don't feel it yet. I'm acting like it's no makeup. Big not glue down. Travis spark is on. Like type of. And yeah. We got a house from Airbnb. I really hate when people text me every day or every other day and like I barely be texting you back or you know I text you back slow why do you keep texting me clearly I don't want to text you you're boring what the fuck I just don't get it I wouldn't be texting somebody that I text a lot that didn't really text me back that's dumb you didn't just talk to yourself at this point Onyx see something? So he's like looking around. Okay, so. Basically. Yo. What'd you see? Okay, so basically, um, long story short. We didn't even get to go to the beach, guys, because Oh goodness. What are you doing? Okay, so yeah, long story short, we didn't go get to go to the beach. I'm about to give you guys a quick, quick summary of why we didn't go to the beach. Not even a summary. I'm just gonna do a little story time. So boom. We got an Airbnb um down in Portsmouth, Virginia. It's the 757, so not DMV, but 
down that, that area or whatever. I'm not the one to like, oh, that's not DMV, is it? Cause I don't give a fuck. But literally 75 is damn near North Carolina. So, um, <laughs> don't hate me if you're from 75. I love y'all, just playing. Child, let's just say the Airbnb basically was some shit, okay? It was some shit. Let me rewind. Some parts of the Airbnb was some shit. Like the kitchen was some shit. And like the dining room area was some shit. But the um, living room was like the cutest little space. Like it had like, you know those wooden floors that are kind of like gray? Oh, I see it. What is trying to help onyx get the damn fly i just let it out the window but um yeah so we got airbnb airbnb an airbnb down portsmouth because the plan was to have a girl's quick getaway it was my best friend her mom and her godmom and we was just going cool it chill out be at the beach have fun drink you know whatever we wanted to do but so yeah Back to the Airbnb. Wooden floors were nice. It was like, you know, that color that's like kind of like a gray, white wood. It was like that in the living room. Cool. Upstairs, upstairs was okay. Upstairs was okay. Um, outside wasn't that bad. I mean, when we first pulled up, we seen like some nigga like geeking, like tweaking off like probably some heroin or something. I don't know, some white, white guy. And I was like, oh God, like we is in the fucking hood, you know? Yeah, everything was good. So Friday we went and um, did a little bit of like shopping as far as like getting like, what did we get? Juice for our liquor, um, a little bit of snacks. And then we went and we found the crab place. In the previous clips, you will see what I'm talking about, like the crabs that we got. So after that, we um, came back in the house, we made the crabs, cooked them, and then um, we turned up. So, why the fuck the Airbnb had roaches? Roaches. The Airbnb had roaches. Y'all, mm, I don't give a fuck what type of bug it is. One bug that I cannot tolerate at all is a roach a fucking roach roaches are fucking disgusting dude i feel like you have to be really filthy for roaches to come about you know what i mean like come on now like how the fuck were you living no shade to nobody because we didn't all then came from some fucked up situations you know what i'm saying but it's like as an airbnb host why the fuck would you even like let somebody rent your space knowing that you got ro roaches let me tell y'all her, her backstory. Um, yeah, I seen one roach the other day. So I called the people like, you know, to come and spray. I called the people and they came or whatever. So everything should be straight. No, it shouldn't. It should never be straight. If it was up to me and she told me that story, I'd have been like, oh yeah, well, give me my money back. We're going to pick another, a different Airbnb or whatever. I guess, I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> but first of all, no, we did. The first one we saw was in the kitchen sink. It was real small, one of the, like the little small jokes. Chanel was like, Paris, come here, right? Cause she didn't want to make a scene. Like, you know, cause you know, we were all excited to be there, but she, yeah, she didn't want to make a scene. So she was like, Paris, come here. I came in the kitchen and she like, look, kill it. So we opened the bottom of the sink and they had like uh, the roach spray. So I sprayed it and I was like, I was looking at her like, bitch, nah. In my head, you know, at least 
you know, I didn't want to be a party pooper, but I also didn't want to be being in a house with roaches or sleeping in a fucking place with roaches. I just, but I ain't say nothing. She ain't say nothing until we saw another one. It was like on the floor. I think this was her mom. Her mom might have seen it. And she like stomped that joint out. And then me and Chanel looked at each other. And she was like, oh yeah, me and Paris already seen one in the kitchen. <laughs> her mom was like, why the fuck y'all ain't been saying something? So basically, we got trashed. We got fucked up that night. And went to sleep. I had to get drunk. I wasn't gonna be able to go to sleep without getting drunk in a house with roaches. Onyx, stop running past here. We get fucked up. We get we wake up in the morning. It's pouring, raining in the 75 where the beach is. So it's pouring, raining. And at this point, we just want to get out that house. We is just, ugh. I actually need to go. I'm gonna try to find our Airbnb. But so we, um, so we ended up, you know, trying to find a hotel. But since we had Willow with us, which is Chanel's puppy, it wasn't too many hotels, and you know, accepting pets. So yeah, long story short, we ended up just going back home because it's like, we can drink and turn up at home. We can't go to the beach because it's wet and rainy. So we might as well just go home. We left. We sat in traffic for like three hours. Like sit still traffic too. Maybe she took it off because we told her she shouldn't rent to nobody else until she get that shit under control. Maybe she took it down. I really want to find it because I want y'all to see it. Damn, I can't find it. I'm going to ask Chanel if she got the pictures from her godmom. I don't want to text her godmom, but hey, send me them pictures. She can be like, who is you showing this embarrassing piece of shit to? Because that's like secondhand embarrassment for real, for real life. Um, that was my second time getting snaked out with an Airbnb. They be trapped the fuck out. And I don't like it. I just rather just be in a hotel room. Put me in a hotel room with a nice cozy bed with the tight ass sheets. You got pool cover tucked so good. You got to pull it out. All that other shit. Mm -mm. I ain't living in nobody's house that you living in. But you at your boyfriend's house for the weekend renting your Airbnb. I mean, renting your house out on Airbnb. Ciao. But yes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini story time. Um, Wednesday, I will be posting a life update. So stay tuned um, for that. And yeah, thanks for rocking with me. Love y'all. Peace.